Um, good afternoon, good evening, and good morning, um, wherever you are at or whatever you're doing today. Thank you for clicking in and uh, listening to this um, audio. All right, um, Free Swazen Movement here, FSM. Right, what are we going to be talking about today? Or just, you know, briefly uh, explaining to, to the Swazi people. Right, um, the power of social media, hashtags, hashtag, hashtag, right? Um, if we could get uh, at least 100, 100 people or more than that, maybe 100K, I think 100K, 100,000, not K, but 100,000 people who could hashtag um, anything, like um like obviously the soldiers we've got soldiers who are marching and with their AK forty sevens and bullets across their chest in in uh, there there's a video you can see it here, um hashtag United Nation. Just hashtag as much as you hashtag United Nation hashtag um ICC which is the International Court I think International Court of Court of Justice, um int- um hashtag uh, the President of United States. Biden, hashtag him, hashtag the White House, hashtag um, the Commonwealth, hashtag Commonwealth, Dra- especially underneath anything that you think the world should know. It's important that we spread the, the, the message to the world because right now you, you guys can see Marcos Ativa is, is rebranding himself he's going around trying to you know you've seen him with hh trying to be a very nice guy you've seen him um bribing um the commonwealth the baroness um, patricia scotland so hashtag guys hashtag patricia scotland if there's anything that you guys know is against human rights as um, makositiv has done the dead bodies whatever it is that you can hashtag um Everything that the police are doing, hashtag uh, the, uh, uh, Biden, hashtag any um, anybody in um, you know the EU, the United the EU organization, the human rights organizations, the what the, the 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 any organization, especially the United Nations. So what we're trying to say is that we need to spread this, right? You guys did a very good job when it, when um, uh, King Swati went to Singapore and you know tried to put on a, a fake image of what was happening in the country, right? It's not that we have an issue with the Singapore business people, Federation Singapore. They, we don't have a problem with anybody. We just don't want to be represented by King Swati and the family anymore. That's it. So we don't have a problem with business people, but they cannot work with us now. Because when they come to our country, they're here to work with our blood. We are the ones who have to work with them. So the, when the people say we are not working, Makositiv does not represent us anymore. If he goes out there and he says that the, the nation we need we need people to come and invest whatsoever, we have to hashtag those companies and let them know that no, not at this moment. Thank you so much that you guys want to do business with Swaziland. But at the moment, we want to remove this guy. The only thing we want from you as a country or a business uh, association or organization like Singapore is to help us remove the current monarchy that is eating everything. We expose, expose, expose to the world. It's very important that we expose the filth that Marcos Ativa is doing. Right, I just want to co- say congratulations to these young lions that we saw, young kids who understand what human rights are and what pa- what the power that they possess. They know who they are. These young kids know whom they are. And you've got all these old guys with guns whom, who are so puffed up with muscles, who eat a lot of meat and a lot of um, some chemicals to look puffed up and beefy and like Bo Van Damme with guns. Look at how, look at that. Then you've got these young boys who are like, we are demanding democracy at that age. So I pr- I wish and I, I'm actually not even wishing if any any school anybody this is beautiful this is beautiful these young kids are fighting for their rights and let me tell you what my police and their mom do not touch those little children okay because UNICEF is watching you not the Swazi UNICEF because that one I don't know but maybe, you know I'm not sure what they're doing but don't touch those children the world is watching. So right now we need to hashtag Makositiv is going around trying to rebrand himself. You saw him wearing glasses and saying that he's a businessman with his children. And then you've got these. I, I want. We also want to as FSM. We also want to address 
you know these you know the the you know look at the la ma poisa la ma soja la la pese di pam la 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 in that circle in the school pull up these guys you know them we all know who these people are we know these soldiers we yeah but spati bonge baga baga also we know them you sleep with them you date them you cook for them you wash their uniform for them you even polish their shoes you even have children with them they are your cousins they are your friends they, you know them we all know them you have to, it is your duty especially women ni ne ba fati le nshatela ma soja ne ma poyisa umfatu wa ntsinzibala who is ntsinzibala we married to those women la ba fati la ba la ba ka bo minister bo ngumalo and this one who just finished lying on national um television law I don't know what's his name again. I think he's a spokesperson. He just finished lying, and the world knows he's a liar now. And he's having issues with the fact that we are trying to, to speak out and against um, Makosi Tive and the way he's doing things. He's like he's not happy. Hashtag guys, Maswati, use social media. Yes, Kanye will try and close it down the MTN, but push. It is the most powerful weapon. Social media is the most powerful. Use Twitter, use Instagram, use Facebook, use whatever you can. Spread the message so the world can know that Marcos Diva is a murderer. He's a criminal. He's a thief. He's a dictator, and also he's a rapist. He's everything, and we don't want him anymore in the country. So I just want to say congratulations. Well done to these young lions. And I, I, I am saying again, do not touch those little children do not touch them so yeah it's free swazi movement we love you guys please use social media hashtag united nation if we can get a hundred thousand hashtag hashtag as much as you want and biden joe biden the president of usa and any other um senator or anybody anybody who works with with international organizations hashtag those things that represent that stand for people and and work for uh, for justice don't sit down and just write things always hashtag expose expose the kingdom of eswatini especially those in authority bomumalo nabokumalo those were the ministers all these ministers are working around akositiv expose those people we need to expose them we are winning it does it looks like we're not i know he saw you know it looks like we're not but we are winning democracy belongs to the people the people will govern thank you swaziland Free Swaziland movement here. We love you and have a good day. Thank you.